We're in the thick of strawberry season, and to celebrate, we're showcasing the seasonal fruit with a unique take on a Collins drink. And here to break it all down for us is mixologist Carolina Gonzalez. Thank you for Hello. coming in. Thank you so much for having okay, me. Okay, so we're making a strawberry Collins. Correct. How is that different from, say, a regular Tom Collins? So regular Tom Collins, um, well, it's a classic cocktail. Mm -hmm. um, it is a base spirit, lemon juice, and a little bit of sugar topped with carbonated water. Okay. okay. So that's your standard. Sure. And so today we're going to do a little twist um, based on that, um, as well as um, adding seasonal ingredients. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So let's get started. Let's get started. All, All right. right. So we're going to grab your shakers, mm -hmm. um, and this is very easy to make at home as mm -hmm. well. Um, we are going to start off with fresh squeezed lemon juice, mm -hmm. three-fourths of that. Mm -hmm. Okay. And please use fresh squeezed lemon juice. <laughs> don't, don't buy the fresh one in the plastic container. Do not buy the one in the plastic container. You know what? It has such a um, chemical taste to mm -hmm. it, oh. and nothing better than just a fresh fruit itself. Okay. Okay. I mean, it's, it comes from food as well. Okay. Nothing better than fresh food, fresh fr okay. fruit as well. All right. Then we're okay. going to go with our strawberry syrup. Mm. And this strawberry syrup is super easy to make at home as well. Equal parts of sugar and water. Infuse your fresh cut strawberries in there. Let it sit, strain, and there you have it. Okay. Super okay. easy. When you mean infuse the strawberries in there, you just, let just put the strawberries in there with the water and sugar and let them yeah. cook down. As soon as, no, as soon as um, you boil the sugar and then you dissolve the sugar, you remove it from the heat. Okay. Uh -huh. You put fresh cut strawberries in After. there, set okay. it on site, and forget it. Oh, <laughs> For at least gosh. about like 15 minutes or so. Okay. It ships out all of the juiciness of the fruit as well as a color, so you uh, get this beautiful red uh, color. Um, and it's super easy to make at home. I mean, a lot of people have already known how to make simple syrup. Mm. Uh -huh. so Clearly just, not you me. You can infuse everything. <laughs> yeah, and you can infuse everything. Teas, um, fruit, okay. every single I thing do, that comes I, in your mind. Oh, I, I do right? it, girl. I do it, I do it. Awesome. And we're using shochu? We are using shochu. So today we're using Ishko Saiten. Um, shochu is a very, um, power, like, very popular uh, spirit from Japan. Mm -hmm. um, it's similar to like our vodka. Mm. So they use it in popularity. So mm -hmm. they use it a lot in every single cocktail. Mm -hmm. This particular shochu has a little bit of overproof of alcohol, mm. uh, which is a little bit stronger, but it's perfect to mix with cocktails. Okay. Um, and they do have another version that's a little bit lower um, mm -hmm. and lighter, mm -hmm. but it has that white peach floralness to it, mm -hmm. versus this one has jasmine and a little bit of more of umami, which oh. is a little bit more savoriness mm. as okay. well. Right. So we're gonna go ahead and do two ounces of this. Okay. Two ounces of the shochu. shochu. Yeah. Okay, you, you know, and I was telling you in the break, I'm not a fan <laughs> of this, but you said you were gonna, you're gonna change my mind. I'm gonna change your mind, and honestly, um, I work at Woodwind, I'm the beverage director there, okay. and I think I've done about five summer menus with using Ishko. Okay. okay. And it, everybody loves it, and not everybody's familiar with it. Okay, So All right. everybody loves it, and I will change your mind. Just okay. come and visit me. Okay, come visit you. All right. For sure, we're gonna put a little bit of ice cubes in here. Mm -hmm. We just wanna dilute it a little bit. Um, Cause and it is add a little bit. <laughs> it's not overproof, technically. Oh, okay. It's well, higher, it's higher um, alcohol content than okay. normal shochu. Well, there you go, mm -hmm. okay, there you go. So we're gonna just give it a nice Little shake. Shake. I, I, I love it. Get it, girl. Get it, right? Get it. Elegant Just shake. a little bit, you know. Yeah, get those. Just to get a nice little dilution as well as um, change the temperature mm -hmm. on it. Mm -hmm. We're going to grab your Collins glass, and ironically enough, this is called the Collins glass. Oh. Um, so we are going to put a couple of ice cubes in here. Nice. Ooh. Maybe one more. Some gorgeous ice cubes there. Ah, nice right. little ice yeah. cubes, right? Yeah. We're gonna go ahead and strain. Pretty pink Our color. Our pretty color here. And then we still top it off with. We are the... gonna top it off with elderflower tonic. Mm. So it's gonna give you a little bit of the floralness as well as it's gonna open up the aromas and the flavor of Ishko. Well, this looks delicious. I think we're going to put all the information up there on the screen for you there. Theishko.com. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. And obviously, you cannot have a summer cocktail without making it look pretty. Sure. Right? So we are going to go ahead and grab these gloves here. Mm -hmm. Oh, mixologists and yes. bartenders, they, we love to work with our hands. Uh -huh. um, we have nice little cute tools to also pick these up, but... Always hands are better. <laughs> She's going to spank the mint one. I am going to spank, spank the mint. Spank the mint but in the glass. So it opens up the oils of the mint. Ooh, she spoke it into the glass. Yeah. Beautiful. Ooh, and as soon as you like take a nice little um, taste to it, you're gonna have an explosion of mint. Oh. Mm -hmm. And then we're gonna go ahead and garnish it with a pretty little orchid flower here. 
Oh, I smell it. Isn't that yes, it? Yes. Absolutely. And, that yes. and then here stunning. is your strawberry Collins. And it's a great um, summer cocktail as well. And it pairs really well with your ponchu burger. Ponchi, ponchi burger, is that what it's called? Ponchi, ponchi, ponchi burger, burger. Yes. <laughs> yeah. That's what it's called. So it pairs really well. Well, thank you so mm -hmm. much for being with of us course. today. Thank we really appreciate it. And I think it's delicious, right? It is. All right. Did we change your mind? You do. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. We have more work done. Huh? Okay, that's right. Caroline, <laughs> thank good. you so much. Of course. Thank you so much for having me.